Hey everyone, Kerry here with Ask Colat, presented by Rudis. If you got any questions or comments, please leave them at the bottom of this uh, video, and Rudis will get them to me, or you can tweet them at me and or email Rudis, and and uh, they'll make sure I get the questions. Question I'm getting a lot, and and I see it a lot on uh, social media platforms is is uh, some people are upset with the Final X format and the World Team Trials, and, and I think they feel like they're being cheated because they're moved around and. You know, they want to. You know, people are asking me my opinion on them, and and um, what do I think about it? Well, when I first heard we were going to do Final X and we were going to wrestle the World Team Trials in three different cities, I wasn't sure. Um, and I, I'd, I'd rather sit back and see how it goes and and um, how it played out. What I can tell you is this: you know, um, going back, you know, from my Olympic team days, um, that's 19 years ago. And then if we start running into when I was making the World Team prior to that. Um, you know, you're looking at over 20 some years of wrestling in, in, in terms of the world team trials and how many I, I had participated in. And I, they were in Philadelphia at the Palestra during my, my main quad when I was actually making teams. Um, we had them in Vegas one year. We had them in Philly. We had them in uh, Waterloo, Iowa one year. And, you know, then and they were in Philly for a long time because of the Foxcatcher days. Um, and you had the best wrestlers in the United States. And we really did only have like you know, maybe two to 500 people in the stands to watch the best wrestlers in the United States compete. Um, you know, during the Olympic trials, it was, you know, in Dallas and, you know, Texas wasn't a real big wrestling state that, at that point. Now it's up and coming. Um, and, you know, I, I, I think there might have been, you know, I can't really remember. Maybe there was five, six thousand people possibly for the Olympic trials in Dallas. Um, and so, you know, not being sure about Final X when it first came out. It had it, it carried more weight than the other trials, and, and and I think three locations was too much, and I think the format this year of two locations um, was right on, and everything I can gather is it, it you know it was a packed house and it was exciting, and um, the format is um, you know different than when I wrestled. We you know we had the mini tournament, and you had to get through the mini tournament before you could start the process up the ladder. Um, you know, so that was how it sat when I when I competed. Um, I like the format now. Um, I don't disagree with it. I, I don't. Um, I think it, I think it's spot on, and I think it's working. You know, our guys are competing well. We're winning medals uh, every time we go to the world championships. And so this social media platform that you know we have now, and in um, and the media coverage between what Rudis is doing as a platform, what uh, fine, what Flo is doing, what Track Wrestling is doing, um, it's grown. You know, it's definitely grown. So. I have no qualms about it. I think it's um, I think it's been really good, you know, and, and it's helped, and it's definitely helping. And I think the the MMA crossover is is also helping with the exposure for our sport. And so I like it. Um, you know, that's my opinion on it. And, and um, you know, hopefully we just keep finding ways to tweak it and make it better and better. Um, all right, again, this is um, Ask Colat, and if you got any questions, just um, tweet them at me, and I'll talk to you all next week.